New York State Senator Charles Schumer was at Sly Borough Cider House, located at Hicks Orchard in Granville today, to unveil his new plan to increase hard cider sales across our state, a move that could benefit New York's 650 apple growers. The hard cider market is a must-watch. According to Ibis World, an analyst of the beverage industry, sales of domestically produced cider have tripled just in the last five years. From 178 million to 601 million. That means in a few years this is going to be a billion dollar industry. Isn't that great? Hard cider is increasingly popular in bars, restaurants, and stores. The Cider Investment and Development Through Exercise Tax Reduction, or for short, Cider Act, would reform the definition for hard apple and pear cider in the Internal Revenue Code, allowing producers to increase their allowed alcohol by volume from 7% to 8.5%. So, when either our growers are thinking of producing more, or our apple grower, our, I mean our existing cider producers are thinking of producing more, or <clears throat> when an apple grower is thinking of going into cider, they say, wait a minute, this tax is a real barrier. And if we could get the tax down to be the same tax as beer, which it should be, it would cost less. Schumer says making a change in the tax code would add up to big savings for cider producers. Currently, beer is taxed at 23 cents a gallon, but hard cider is taxed at $1.07. For Look News, I'm Megan McDavid.